Today I'll show you how I created this 3D rotation on these images using PowerPoint. So to recreate this effect where the images are on a 3D rotation, we're going to go to PowerPoint on a blank presentation. Insert the pictures. So we'll start with picture one here. So right now, this is just on a level playing field. You right click on the image and go to format picture. From here, you go to the option called 3D rotation. And you can, you could uh, start using these options here and test what they do and find the one that works best. But my quick tip today is just go to the presets, go to the custom drop down arrow, and it already does it for you. So I could test this one for instance, and kind of it does it for me without me having to do a lot of uh, messing around. The one that I found worked for me for that other thumbnail was this one perspective contrasting, right? So I select that, and I think that works really well there's not much I need to do with that so I'll insert another one go back to insert pictures and pick two and I can do the same thing here go to presets select contrasting right again and uh, I can go on the top left hand corner to shrink it down in size or increase it where I as I see fit and again, repeat the process. I'll go this one instead. Go over presets. So I do it one after the other. And when you add a shadow to this, so I'll go to shadow. Again, go to presets, drop, drop down arrow. And given the incline it's on, I'm going to select bottom left and you'll notice that little shadow effect so I'll do the same thing on the other ones bottom left and I can increase the size of that shadow by going to size clicking up on that arrow there and it adds it and th look there's a number of things I can do with this I, I can add another uh, another set of uh, presets so picture color if I wanted to let's say this one and go over here and do another one color saturation so we can add that so it gives it can give it a, a really cool effect but the main thing to understand is when you select format picture and 3D rotation it there are already preset um, designs for you to give you that modern look and then you can play around with the other presets as you desire and that's how I created that other thumbnail so this is a quick tip for today um, would love to hear your feedback uh, or subscribe to keep up to date with this uh, series that I'm producing see you in the next video